Okay, I'm going to be brief. And I'm going to be crass, all right? When it comes to spiritual warfare, it is my abilities is just an outward expression of what I do and what I'm able to do when dealing with negative entities. Uh, not in a combative situation, but in a defensive situation and combative, but not not fighting, not punch to punch. It's more so like a, uh, you know, staying positive and uh, blessing that spirit. Um, there is a message and you need to know, all need to know that you have to understand that um, that God is for all of his children. And it's hard for somebody to have been, let's say someone who was in jail, somebody who had been uh, emotionally, uh, you know, uh, in torment uh, in some sense, mainly on themselves, um, to to hear that God will accept them back with open arms, all right? Uh, it's not always seen as a good thing um, with all spirits, but that is the message. And this is, and in, in through us all keeping our energy positive and keeping that high vibration, um, all of us will be able to walk together into a new world, a new earth, and that is the fire that must be maintained, which which will put an end to all of the badness. Okay? That's what this is. That's what that is. All right? Prayer warriors, that's what we need. All right? Don't pray for badness. Pray for goodness. Fight, keep fighting the bad, conquering the bad with the good. That is how we battle. And you might get you might get hurt, but or or something, and that's what that ability is for, to block. You know what I'm saying? To be able to deal with these things and still yet be loving. It is very difficult at times. And these Enemies are very smart. That's why self-conditioning, you know, is important. Be blessed.